the topic that I would like to emphasize on that we as humanity has gone through different stages of development and civilization, economical civilization, from being hunters to farmers to industrial age to knowledge and information age. I believe like many other healthcare provider leaders worldwide that the next age called the wisdom age in which we deal with the human being as a whole mind, body, heart and spirit. This paradigm shift in healthcare in, in managing uh, our customers, our patients and our employees is going to be the cornerstone for success in the next century. This paradigm dictates that we handle human beings and deal with them mind, body, heart and spirit. For example, in healthcare, the mind respecting the intellect of our patients, respecting the intellects of our colleagues, teach with kindness, establish organizations that respect the mind of the individuals and have them share in the decision making. The body component, no compromise in the quality of health care. The spirit component, how do you create an environment in which the health care providers feel that they could fulfill their legacy in life through working in this organization. I truly believe that in the next century, only organizations which are going to apply this paradigm and shift from the industrial and information age to the wisdom age, only those organizations will excel simply because once you do that, you unleash a potential, uh, a great potential from every individual far exceeds the increased productivity that we have witnessed moving, moving from one uh, economical civilization to the other. First, it starts with the right leaders understanding what it means to excel in the next decade. We start with the human being, with the individual. No longer is going to be the industry, the technology. All of these are tools. But at the end of the day, unless you tap into the greatest source and energy, which is the heart and the minds of the individuals of your organizations, you will not be able to excel in the next decade. So it starts with the right leaders understanding what it takes to get out and, and uh, the potential uh, and unleash that potential from each individual by respecting the mind, body, heart and spirit and no longer apply the old paradigm in healthcare. Uh, in the International Medical Center, we have started putting the seeds. That's why our mission is uh, pioneering a unique uh, uh, example of healthcare. Uh, that unique example which applies the mind, body and soul and abiding by the divine standards and the highest uh, level of technology as a tool to apply that. That's the problem with people who think medicine is like any other industry. Medicine is different. It's not about, in healthcare, organizations are not like an assembly line or a machine. It's an organism. And because the most important factor in success of delivering healing, I'm talking about healing, not cure here, is the individual. It's vital that this individual be able to be utilized to its most, unleash its potential, and be able to connect to its consumers patients and be able to extend that arm of healing. There is no way for healthcare providers to be able to extend their arm of healing unless they themselves feel that they are dealt with in a holistic approach and they themselves feel that they are the wellness of their heart, mud, heart body, mind and spirit.